I'm often asked about medical negligence and it's true that we do rely on our doctors, nurses and health professionals generally to look after us and perhaps keep us alive. If they make a mistake and you suffer as a result of that, then you may be entitled to compensation. It's not enough that just a mistake is made. A doctor or a nurse must be grossly negligent uh, in order for compensation to be available. But if that is the case and we can prove it, then you should be entitled to compensation for the pain and suffering that you've had, plus any other losses such as loss of earnings as a result of not being able to go to work. Now the way we do it is not just you saying something has happened or me saying something's happened, you and I are not doctors. We get expert testimony, expert reports from specialists who are at least as qualified as the people who have been treating you. And if those reports show that there's been gross negligence, then either the doctors or the local health board or whichever organisation is in charge of the doctors that are dealing with you will settle. They will pay up compensation plus your legal costs. If they disagree as to the cause of the problems or say that the doctor wasn't grossly negligent but was just exercising discretion properly, then the matter may have to go to court. And if you sue, then it's up to a judge to decide if the doctors have been negligent and uh, there again, the expert reports uh, from other doctors are crucial. It's not 100% certain, but what we can do is we can assess your claim and with the benefit of expert reports, tell you if you've got a good chance of compensation.